Hey guys, I'm Drew, and for my book talk, I'm doing Tiger vs. Nightmare by e Emily Tetri. So, um, some previous background work by Emily Tetri. She's done a lot of animation. Um, this is her first book, but she's worked extensively with animation. She has worked with DreamWorks, Nickelodeon, and she currently works on a show on Cartoon Network. And she does the background paint, and she's a supervisor. Um, but this is her first book, Tiger vs. Nightmare. And, um, it has to do with our main character, Tiger, who has her own personal monster. She has her own monster that protects her at night from getting a nightmare. And it's pretty cool. And um, so when she's having a nightmare, the monster always steps in and protects her. But what happens in the book is it shows what happens when the monster fails. What happens when the monster can't protect Tiger anymore? Because w when you go to sleep, you're very vulnerable. And you're having a nightmare. And there's not much you can do. But the monster is there to always protect and defend Tiger. But what happens when the monster can't protect her from the nightmare? Well, we'll have to read Tiger vs. Nightmare to find out. So we're going to pick up in the middle. And we're going to join Tiger and her monster. Always the same routine. Monsters scared away the nightmares with ease. Nightmare shows up, monster shoes it away, shoo! Nightmare approaches monster, Nightmare has its mouth like really close to monster's head. <laughs> So monster has to slam it closed. They fight. Get out of here. I'm not afraid of you. Thwack. Oh no, it looks like monster's hurt. Ow. Then we see Nightmare approaching Tiger. I'm sorry. Nightmare gets ready to give Tiger his nightmare. The next morning, Tiger was confused. The last time she had a nightmare, Monster had been on vacation. She'd have to wait until nightmare, uh, until nighttime to ask what happened. Monster was never around during the day. It was a very sleepy day. Tiger at dinner, his parents poke him, poke. Tiger talks to Monster. So did you, did you go somewhere last night? Mm. I had a nightmare last night. And you keep those away. Where were you? I, um, I don't know. I guess one slipped through somehow. Don't worry, it won't happen again. Brush, brush, brush. Tiger brushes his teeth. He gets ready to go to bed. 
monsters there to defend him. Monster sits ready to approach the nightmare. Nightmare arrives. The monster faces off right against the nightmare. Nightmare's head and monster's head touch. They fight. Monster approaches. The nightmare approaches Tiger. Quick, get under the covers. Okay, I think we're safe under here. The nightmare looms outside. The next night. Okay. Soothing tea for easy sleep. Check. Relaxing bedtime stories for sweet dreams. Check. <laughs> And I found armor for you. Helmet, shield, sword, shin guards. You got this. Want to find out what happens to Tiger in Tiger vs. Nightmare? Well, you'll have to read the rest to find out.